album Remedies for Perfect Feet. We tend to care for our hair, hands, and face, but seem to forget about our feet all too often. It shouldn't be that way. They are your support and have to be the first to be cared for and pampered. They are also the most to be affected by walking, wearing tight shoes, walking barefoot, doing exercise, etc. In the long term, this can be a problem. Besides aesthetic purposes, it is good to keep your feet in perfect state to prevent more serious problems in the future and also to show them off in sandals in the summer. Your feet, your roots. Many people can say that your feet are the most important part of the human body. They support you and allow you to go from one place to the other as well. Nature has given you resistant and strong feet, but this doesn't mean that they don't get affected. It is very common to have cracked feet, with calluses and blisters. Besides having your nails painted to match your bathing suit, the truth is that your feet need a lot more attention than what you occasionally give them. You most likely think about your hair, then your face, and then your hands. Your feet come in last, at the least. In order to show off amazing feet, you should follow a frequent care and maintenance routine. This can cost you a little bit of time, but keep in mind that it will translate to overall well-being, that you will notice even in your facial expressions. Tricks to care for your feet In order to have perfect feet, like a model's, with no hard skin, calluses, or cracked heels, you just have to have a little bit of time every week. Follow these tips. You should do a weekly foot bath with sea salt for a half hour. A big task, you can do it while you watch television or while painting your fingernails. This will make them look more relaxed and rested, especially if you standing or sitting down all day at work. Every 15 days, do a hot water bath for a few minutes, immediately followed by a cold water bath. This combination will improve your feet circulation. If you add a few drops of lemon to the water, you will prevent them from smelling bad. Use a pumice stone whenever you can. It is a vital element for caring for your feet. It is a volcanic rock that is very porous but low in density that you can find in any beauty store or supermarket. After showering or a hot bath, use this stone to gently scrape the areas where calluses form on your feet, especially on your heels. Massage your feet every night before going to sleep with a moisturizing cream or essential oil. This will relax them and prevent calluses. Massage in circular movements and with a little bit of pressure. Walk barefoot, do ankle rotations, and walk on tiptoes around your house. In this way. You will strengthen your feet. Even a roll a ball underneath them to massage and improve your soul's circulation. After showering, dry your feet well between your toes so that fungus doesn't form. If you sweat a lot, 
Use Dial Compounder. Use cushioned insoles and don't wear very tight shoes every day. Wearing heels isn't the best alternative either. Cut your nails horizontally to prevent them from becoming ingrown or deformed, weak, or growing normally. If you go to a beauty salon for a pedicure, make sure that the tools they use are of high quality and are trusty because they can cause infections. Reflexology is one of your options if you like alternative medicine. It stimulates your body's defenses and helps get rid of toxic substances. It consists of pressing certain points, which are connected to your nervous system, on the soles of your feet. Remedies for Perfect Feet In addition to the aforementioned tricks, these remedies are great for showing off your beautiful feet all year round. Exfoliate your feet with a special cream. Just take whatever lotion you use and add 2 tablespoons of sugar. Massage your heels with this preparation. The friction will eliminate dead cells. Bananas have curative powers for your feet. Just beat two bananas in a blender until you get a paste. Put it on your heels after showering. Leave it on for 10 minutes and remove it with warm water. Repeat this process once a week. Vegetable oil, you may not like the feeling at first, but you should keep in mind that it's very effective for dry or cracked feet. Once you wash and dry them well, put your feet in a bowl with hydrogenated oil. Wear thick socks all night. Remove dead cells. You can do it three times a week. The lemon juice and Vaseline is an amazing remedy for dry and cracked feet. After washing them, put this mixture on. Mix two handfuls of salt with three tablespoons of avocado oil and two drops of mint oil. Massage this on your feet for 3 minutes and then put them in warm water to completely remove it. Besides getting rid of calluses, you will prevent bad odor.